everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Little C here. Today is going to be another episode of Quick Time Number Two. We'll be making my homeland favorite dish, pho. Can you guess where I come from? You got it right. It's Vietnam. When I tell people I'm Vietnamese, they say, "Oh my God, I love pho." They can't pronounce it right. It's pho with an attitude. Get it right or don't eat it. I mean, I'm kidding. <laughs> Please do enjoy. They're so good for you in a cold winter, when you're hungover, or just everyday life. If you want it, go get some. But we're just so busy and we never have time to make one or to go and get one. So I'm gonna show you how to make it in under 15 minutes. Let's go. Here are the ingredients that I'll be using. Um, I just got them at Pusateri. Now, if you're not a, a good cutter or a slicer, like me, I'm not really good with knife. I get my meat cut for me as well as my onions. The thinner it is, the better it is. The other thing to make this meals really quick is that you need to put your rice noodle in cold water at least a few hours before you start cooking so that they become really nice and soft like this. Okay, now we're gonna start the timer. My boyfriend's gonna help me and press the button. Commencing cooking in three, Two, one. Okay, so the first thing for this dish is um, the soup. Now usually, it takes forever to get the soup right. Oh, I'm gonna have a hard time opening this. Okay, I usually go and get, um, it's an actual pho um, cube broth, but this store doesn't have it, so the closest I'm gonna get is beef broth. or my secret is adding in chicken stock. I'm going to cover it up. Next is to do the veggie. So I already have the onions out. And then now I'm going to cut a little bit of green onions. Coriander. You know, I always thought that this was parsley when I was growing up. Next, you need some lime. Just a little bit of the oyster sauce, a little bit of the rice sauce. We got two pho on the plate. Oh my god, okay guys, this was a very, very close call. I tried to do two portion. I did do one completely. Um, it was done. Now all you need to top it up with is a little bit of lime. You can add in a bit of um, oyster around. I'm not really that much into spices, so I'm just gonna leave the hot sauce alone. But there you go, you have pho in 15, that way, 15 minutes. Oh my god, it smells so good. <sighs> it smells okay. really good. Okay, we're gonna go and try it now. The beef did cook, even though it was a bit thick. Uh huh. Mmm. 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 The beef is really good. Mmm. Okay, um, I think it's time to stop eating in front of the camera so that we can actually have dinner. <laughs> No way, you have to try the bread. I'm gonna try the bread. Okay, let's you try the bread. I'll try it after. Mmm. 
Vabbè. Okay, I know you like to keep eating, but can we go eat dinner? <laughs> so that's it for our video today. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please give us one big thumbs up if you do like it. And comment down below if you have other dishes that you want me to try to do an express or quick time eating on. Remember to subscribe and follow me on Instagram, just right there. Okay, see you next time. Bye!